Hey guys, it's Natasha. Um, as promised, I am doing a haul video for you guys today. Um, like I stated yesterday, um, Thursdays here in Arizona is a uh, dollar day. And today was pink tag. And if you looked at my thumbnail, today was probably in the five years that I've been reselling and thrifting was probably one of one of the highlight of my thrifting career. Um, I got some really good brands and to top it off, I usually I usually don't look at the the jeans and things. I just didn't really see anything that I was really liking or a lot of pink tags in the areas that I normally look, which is the tops and dresses. So today I looked into the jeans more, which I will definitely be doing more often, and I found some really great gems. Um, my I got about 50 plus items, and my total was $101, and I got a few pieces that were not dollar tag because it was just worth it, but I just... Uh, I just put the, the price across however the quantity amount of clothing that I got. So 50 plus, I would say 52 pieces, I'll just say 50 pieces, and I paid $100. So roughly about, I'll just say $2 an item, which I'm totally happy about. So I will just start off with, I got four pairs of shoes, and I'll show those first, and then I will move to the clothing. So the first pair of shoes is just um, a little, like a toddler uh, pair of Columbia slide-on shoes. Really great condition. They um, are a size 10. And then Vionic. These are a size... it says a size 9 but they're in really great condition the top and bottom they're like a metallic color this is my first time filming outside so we'll see if we do this again but hopefully you can tell and then uh, these are a pair of soft sling back heels in really great condition And these are a size 10. And then one other pair of shoes. Are, these are men's New Balance. Shoes. And then I have uh, an Ikea bag over here. And I'm probably going to just after I show you each a uh, clothing item, I'm going to take the tag off and put that in the trash and then put my the item after I show it to you in this other bag just to, so we don't have to keep going back and forth. So this is just a, like a 90, but it's by Vanity Fair. Or like a just a red lingerie maybe this is a Disney uh, Neff size extra large and I'm just noticing it has a small hole in the back but all of these items have not been listed I actually just got back from the thrift store like an hour ago so if there's anything that you like, just message me. Uh, there was not a lot of anything really for dresses, so I just got a few. Emma and Michelle, this is just a pure black dress. It's like a midi length dress. Agnes and Dora. This is uh, like a maxi uh, v-neck dress and it has some detailing on the bottom. I'll show you. 
nice little summer dress. And this is a vest by Yogalicious. And this tag just looked good. Bos Bosina? Bosini? I don't know. I have to look, do more research on it, but it was a dollar, so. And Kate, Caitlin? like a moto jacket. These are a Lafayette 148 dress pants. These are actually new with tag. I didn't notice that until now. $148 tag on these. They got them for a dollar. Pink tag today. And these are a size 10 dress pant. This was also a Magashoni, which I know that's a good brand. This is just a solid shirt, solid orange. This is a, the Zara Man men's jacket. It's a size extra large. It's a, like a, a suede. Let me zip it up. one pair of men's jeans because they're uh, between they're, down here they're between 14 and 19 dollars these are Vulcan jeans they're size 38 and then we got just a couple more dresses And I don't even know if this is good. Uh, discount Divas. Just thought it was a nice summer dress. This is a um, Banana Republic. It's a faux wrapped striped dress. And this looked like a vintage dress. I didn't see any um, designer on it. just going off of this right here. And I got um, two pairs of girls jeans. And I believe they're both, yeah, they're both old navy. They're skinny distressed. These ones are size 10. These ones are size. I don't see the size on these ones. They're both in great condition. And I just thought these were pretty cool. I've never heard of this brand before, but it's called. Uh, Lildy. I think, I don't know if you can see that, but it's a, these are corduroy, just uh, slip-on pants. Navy blue. And these I just got, um, not off of the brand, but just off the really cool color and style of these. They're 
wide leg striped pants. These are size four. Very cool. They're like a, a pink and a purple mauve color. And these are old navy, a linen blend, like just a cozy, cozy pant. These are size large. They're black. These are um, khakis and co. These are a size six. Some really cool pants. They're soft surroundings. They look like they're new. Um, I'll give you guys the style um, number. It's 3A is an apple, Z is in zebra, 30. Pretty cool. Like a palazzo pant almost. Oh, but I should have told you the size. Um, they're a size um, petite small. Then I got two of these. Um, you should have seen it in the picture. They're the level 99, size 29. Um, they're, one of them's a brown, and one of them is a, a gray blue color, but they're both um, a linen blend uh, pant. I see no flaws on them. They're both in pretty basically perfect condition. This is the blend. I don't think I'll be doing videos out here again. It's pretty difficult to see. I'm sorry guys. But the button detail is pretty cool too. I have to look up these actual the type of uh, these are. I will have these listed in my Poshmark closet. And then these uh, cachet are a, like a dressy pant. And they have a zipper on the back. They're like um, pretty cool looking pant. They're size 10. And I got some Madewell pants. They're the Road Tripper, size 28. And they're black. A little bit of pulling right here, but not too bad. Um, some Hudson jeans. They have some really cool detail on the bottom of the pant legs. These are the doesn't say the style, but they are a size 27. And I just got this, it's just apartment 9, but for summer it's just a um, animal print. Let's leave this tank, somebody might like that. These are um, Bowden. I'm pretty sure these are a wool blend pants. Mm. Yes, these are 98% wool. And they're cuffed at the bottom. And 
these are size 10 regular. And then I got uh, two pairs of Beta brand. I've never found these before. I was so excited. One is a pair, um, they're both black. One is just large. These are just, these are, um, just a pull on pant. They don't, um, they don't unzip or anything. I have to look up the style. And the other pair it does unzip and unbutton. And that is a petite large. These are cuffed at the bottom. Um, and a pair of Liverpool jeans, size 12. They're gray. And these are just pull on pants with faux pockets in the front. pair of Bergdor, Bergdor Goodman. And they just, they're a button fly. Stretch pant. They look like they have been hemmed, so I'll have to take the measurements. But they're the Jill Sander. I do not see size. I'll have to search for that. And then a pair of jag, jag um, pull-on pants. They're like a cropped pants. Size 12. They're the classic fit. a couple marks on them, but I think I can get them out. And then, this, these are just some Chico Energy Synergy um, pants, lightweight. And they're a zero, size zero, which is an extra small. And they just have the buckles, almost like a cargo. Pant, but I'm, now that I'm looking at them, I don't know that I'm even going to list them because they look like they have some wear on the bottom, so those may not even get listed. Then I have a Victoria's Secret size extra large burnout top. green envelope, like a peplum on the bottom, a zipper on the back, size small. Uh, juicy couture, size small top. I just got this one for, to, for the 4th of July, the state of mind. This is a size large, and I've not heard of this SIVA. Medium. And then uh, here's an Adidas top, size small. Get all of these soft, soft and sexy tops and just lock them up from American Eagle. But that's my haul. I was very excited about it. Um, I got a couple of other pieces that were um, just like uh, hard goods, like plates and stuff, but I got those for myself, so I didn't add them to this 
but um, I will try to get a bunch of them listed tonight. And if there's anything that you like that I showed you, just send me a message. Alright guys, I'll see you guys tomorrow.